Hey guys, A.V. Songbird here. This is my Friday weight loss vlog that I'm doing once a week for you guys and to keep me on track. Um, I'm going to start out with the bad news. You know, I weighed myself this morning and I'm back up about six ounces. It's probably because I drank my coffee before I weighed myself. But the good news is, you know, it's only six ounces. It's not, you know. But um, I've had a really busy week, and I've been focusing more on around the house and getting things done around here and everything than killing myself on the running and everything. But with as quick a progress as I've made, you know, six ounces, <clears throat> I figure it isn't that bad, but I'm not making the progress I want to. But I know with life and stuff, it sometimes gets busy. But the good news is I had something I wanted to tell you guys. I've been mentioning throughout my vlogs since I started that I wanted to be able to do training to be able to start doing some good, you know, not just doing something for the sake of doing it, but doing it and actually being able to help people. And how with me getting back into my running training, I'd like to do the Relays for Life every year and I'd like to start helping charities and stuff because that's something I'd be interested in doing. I love helping other people, you know, however I can. But um, my husband and I have been doing the Fitbit thing for a while now just to keep us on track and keep us going, you know, with the weight loss and getting healthier and wanting to get our lives back on track and everything. But um, so we've been doing that for a couple of months. He's doing it through his work, you know, and then he got me mine because he's doing it through his work and he likes the competition. So do I. But today I got a note from him on my Twitter because, yeah, I follow my husband on Twitter. I'm such a nerd. But I got a notification that he signed up through Fitbit's website and that starting, I think it's on the 9th, Fitbit is actually doing where they're, it says on the website, everybody's a winner. You've picked the cause that matters most to you. Now get moving and help your charity take the biggest piece of our $1 million donation. And you go to their site, I'll put it a link to the site underneath my vlog today for you guys, those of you that are interested, because it's such a good thing. What they're doing is there's three major um, charities and Fitbit has set aside a million dollars and they're going to donate money based on which charities get the most steps. You know, and you can sign up on the website and you can log in through there and then your Fitbit tracker syncs to the site and your profile and it adds the steps to the charity of your choice. And the first place charity, the one with the most steps, is going to get $500,000 for that charity. The second step is going to get 350000 and the third place is going to get 150000 of the charity money. So it's really a good cause and they're doing, I think it was the American Diabetes Association, they're doing heart disease and then they're doing multiple sclerosis. And I, they're all three really good charities and because my husband and I, you know, I don't want to compete with him on that much of a level. So he and I got together and we're both going for MS. So it's a good thing because one, it'll keep me motivated to keep doing my steps and no, it's not me doing a charity directly, but it's at least a step in the right direction. And I wanted to get the word out to you guys because any of you that have a Fitbit and may not know about this, I figured I'd get the word out and let you guys know, hey, they've got this going on. If you guys are interested, spread the word. This is a really good thing. It could really help with them working on research and getting help to the people that need it. And that's a really good deal. So... I'm going to be, you know, getting back into kicking my butt and, you know, getting back into the running full bore and, you know, trying to get back down to the size I want to get in because now that I'm back in the eights, which is unreal, I laughed because I told my husband, it's weird, I feel like I'm the same size I was when I was in twelves and, you know, sitting here less than two months later from being in the 12s and being in 8s, it feels unreal. And, you know, the thought that I'm still chunky, you know, I'm not skinny as a rail. I can still get down smaller and feel healthier and, you know, have the energy back and be in the kind of shape where the kids got to keep up with me, you know. So I'm looking to get smaller, but I wanted to get on here and, no, I haven't lost any this week, but 
and I'm sorry, you guys, I'm not putting out full sentences. Sometimes I do that. It's still weird for me to be in front of the camera. But um, last weekend, my husband and I went out because we have an acre of land and we were clearing weeds and we did that, loaded up his truck full of weeds and hauled those off. And we're going to be doing yard work again this weekend. And it's so much easier now because it's November, you know. I mean, the weeds build up during the summer months, but you have to figure no one wants to go out there when it's 120 something degrees in the shade and work on weeds, right? I laugh when my parents used to live out here because I've lived in the same area for around 20 years. But when my parents lived out here, my dad had this huge spotlight and, uh, go away. My dad had this huge spotlight and we'd go out in the middle of the night and he'd put up this spotlight and we'd do weeds, you know, out at night. So we didn't do them during the day. We were smart. We were the ones out there at midnight when it's only, you know, a cool 98 degrees with the spotlight doing weeds because we were smarter than that. But yeah, I wanted to let you guys know about the Fitbit um, competition that's coming up and it's for three major charities and you go to their site and you sign up if you want to and your steps actually add up with all the other steps of the people that are doing this and each of the charities is going to get something so you're not only doing something for your health you're not only doing something for your family and for you personally but you could really affect other people's lives doing this and like I said, it's not me doing it directly, but it, it's doing something for someone else for the sake of doing for someone else, you know, and that's a good feeling. So this one's going to be shorter today, which I'm sure you guys will be unhappy about. Boo, yay, don't get to hear her ramble darn. But this has been A.V. Songbird. I think this is Weight Loss Vlog 9, and I wanted to let you guys know how it's going, and I just wrapped up one of my series this week. So I'm going to have more time to get back into the running and especially with, you know, the Fitbit competition starting in, there's a timer on the page. It says starts in two days, seven hours, 35 minutes and 17, 16, 15, 14 seconds. And that's when the race starts. So I wanted to let you guys know before it started, Hey, that's what's going on. You know, in case any of you out there with Fitbits like me, you know, go ahead and let me know. I think it lets you add friends through Twitter. So if any of you have it and you're on my Twitter, I'll look and see, you know, so that we can do this together. I think that would be cool. You know, find a charity that we can work for and go for it. And I'll be there to back you guys up, waving my little flag. You guys know me. I try to be supportive with everyone, you know, and those of you that are doing the weight loss thing with me, you know, it's going to get easier, you guys. The weather's getting cooler now, so get your butt out there and do. <laughs> Have you done your 10,000 steps today? But, yeah, I'm going to let you guys go because my stepsons are going to be here shortly. And I have to go and make sure the gate's unlocked for them because they will be here shortly. And look! I'm excited! We're in sweater weather! But yeah, this has been A.V. Songbird. You guys have an awesome weekend. I'll see you back here on Tuesday is when I post my videos because Monday is me and hubby day. So you guys have a great rest of your day. Bye, guys.